So here's our building. And we've started to perform a series of analysis graphs, of what could be shear and bending moment, as well as deformations. But above all, we have here the results for the maps. In this instance, we can observe our building being affected by the different load cases. And even some combinations. But also, we can appreciate how the containment walls of the underground levels, are being affected by the static loads of the terrain. Although it's true, that we only applied such static load, over one of the sides of the building, being that we should have done that for all the sides of the structure. Nevertheless, here we can observe the results for each of the different load cases and combinations over the structure of our building. And we could very well commence reviewing frame by frame and axis by axis. Verifying at the same time, the diagrams for the shear and bending moments, and well, all the data that we need to obtain an adequate design.